I'm doing 30, then on a 10 o'clock round that kind of thing. Mm. Alright, I was inside. An incident happened in the bathroom, which it wasn't me. Mm. The person that did it was he brother. He knocked on his brother's door. Boom, 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 his brother ain't answer. I was in there. He came to me arguing about, I go do this, I go do that. So I had to put him in place straight. Listen to me. Hear me, don't call my name. He get on your phone, he says, all right. He called the police saying, first, at first he said, he gonna put me out. I got to left in here. So that's when I pulled go for this thing. I tell you, we're laughing here. I ain't laughing in here. Thing, 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 everything I do. We ain't fight on him. I just pulled the stick. I ain't hit you on nothing. He said that he threatened me and never had no words of saying that I ain't hit you on the stick or nothing. He went for the police. Before all the police come, we was out here talking. They had a whole family session out here the whole the night. Mm. So all we out here talking, all right, everybody going on. I going in my bed to sleep. Police come spotting it to me by the window. Around, around what time was that? That it was around one o'clock. Mm. After one, say around one o'clock, one thirty, around that kind of thing. Mm. I don't know to be exact, but I can tell you because, yeah. They come. I messaged my aunt around twelve forty nine. Mm. Minute someone. So all that time we out here, we are we he, 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 they come type my statement. At first I asked my age, I tell them my age, cause they don't know my name. Mm. I tell them my age and thing. Boom. First they listen to my statement. Then they tell me about I have to laugh in here. That the lady that live all in Haggett Hall, Cotton Road, Haggett Hall, that we part live right. Is there a relative, another relative? Yeah. yeah. She's sister. Right. Who this to everybody? Right. She know enough art. To be honest, I raise her in this house. I raise her own all these all these family here. I never raise her own she. She never live She never live in the house at the time I was in here. I got pictures of proof I got pictures standing up right here. We knew right here standing up with my grandmother. All then everybody. I never raised her own she. Before the house come like this, mm. it was better call my aunt here to live in here. It was better than this, but right now it worse. For the man that put me out, that won't own a shit the house, that tell you tonight that we arguing over a house, is who's who arguing over the house. Because the one incident that could have just done us all. Yes, I agree that I put my stick, but I ain't hit your name. But all he does demand me to hand over the keys, I left him this. So I can't do nothing with that. For them, tell me hand over the keys. I'm going to find some place to see. Okay. So this is probably what you mean. Alright, so just, just to get an idea of um, the amount of time that you would have spent in this house, well, how did you um, come to, to live here? And, and at what time did you did you move here? Well, I came here from a baby. From Tommy Barn, I see my only person I see was this lady here. And my grandmother and this lady here too. Yeah. So that if I'm telling you here, I was here from baby. Yes, I get trouble, yes. I do stuff, yeah, yeah, boom, boom, boom. But it's a big man though, and I look past all that there. Try to avoid all that there. I'm working, but whoever the talk with the four police. But as you how you spotting look here now. This is so one of the policemen spotting look in my face. So I could see who's the police. But I could have mack out the one that they seen them right here. Mm -hmm. I know it was a big dark one. Just cause don't make guy going mask, but you know he's a dark man. Mm -hmm. Cause he's big. The last thing I'm on tenderly. I did live with a girl. So they just like I did live with she. Right? Come back. That's not the right lock. That lock there get changed. Mm -hmm. When they come back, I can't gain so. But right now, the keys that they got, I got all two keys. This key and the old, old lock key. For my key. Mm -hmm. I had a sleep outside from this slab here for a month. Before, yeah, before, last year, COVID, last year, COVID. COVID. 
That was when me and the girl place. split up. Mm -hmm. I ended up laughing, but she and thing. Come back down for. You know, you're working. Yeah. So you can't contribute to whatever little thing. So you just said, you know what? I came back home. Mm -hmm. Just to take off that burden off of she. I can move back at like home. You know what I'm saying? Because yeah. she got children and things. So you just said, you know, I ain't come back home. So when I come back home, my things now. I had to sit up from this side here, all my things last year. Saying COVID in lockdown. COVID in lockdown before I could again say this neighbor here see me one night. The lady that I've been here see me one night. Of course, she, she uh, boyfriend with you, she's your father. Which is then called Tasha, no, then it's called Tasha. No. Who's Tasha? Not here. Oh, right. Mm -hmm. right. So, see the situation and things. So, then I ain't getting here no. My father ended up getting in. Mm. Yeah, and we ended up calling police. And police ended up coming too. And police put it back That's in the house. That's why we get back in here. When my grandmother died in the car, it was other living in here. I, in here now, the room that I live in is small, so I, could, I can't walk, I can't turn nothing. Mm. That's who they want me to live in here. So I had to ask the police if we could get a different room. So he had this front in here locked down. Yeah. All the old things in there, which he still got old things in there that he don't use. He got, he got a bedroom that he's sleeping in, but he got, and he, and he got another, all his things he locked down. So, like, I asked the police man if we could get a room. The man tell me, I showed the man what part of the living at first, part of the sleeping before he get back in there. But, you know, the dust and thing, the whole school and thing, blah, blah, blah. I clean up this room here. I asked for this room, for this is my grandmother's room. But should he fuck right? I know what all this. He want this room for this room for the current box. I study in the current for the last time he come back before he change the lock. I would plug in my phone to charge it. He, he going to turn off the current so he can't use the current. Oh, then can't think. But before he get back in the office, he me. Locking the toilet. Locking the toilet. I think I had to back off the lock. All these things. And the toilet ever, the toilet ever no good toilet on him. And he, he won't lock down these things. So, oh. like, so that's why you, you had to call the police last year because oh, any lockdown, he out here sleeping from the concrete slab. Cool. And, and, and the and police thing. let him back in the house. But the police have come tonight saying that he has to leave. I have, yeah. They call the same show them documents saying yeah. that my mother is his legal document and his legal guardian the same. He has to leave. He ain't got no right in the house. He ain't family. And family, I know who's my but there's father, my brother child and I show in the document that show you it's saying my mother's son which is his father mm -hmm. so it would make her his grandmother she's the legal guardian of Ken Rick. Okay.